Hey everybody, welcome back to 3Sport. Let's look at uh, our options of catching a shotgun snap. We're gonna throw the ball, the type of footwork and movement that we wanna have when catching the ball out of the gun and making the different types of throws that we're gonna make. We have to always pay attention as a quarterback and the, the, as the coaches that we're coaching the quarterback that our drops, however we catch it and the movements that we make, are intertwined with the receivers and their pattern. Whoever that is, we have different receivers that run different kind of routes and we have to make sure that we take our drop that when we finish that drop, it's time to throw. So when it's time to throw, we wanna make sure that we are loaded, our feet are on the ground, we're ready, and we're not still messing with our footwork or our backfield action, and we're not ready to throw when the receiver's ready. So the first thing we're gonna do is simply, we catch a shotgun snap, and I want that good posture back here. I wanna make sure we look athletic, Brock. We got our stagger if we want it, but we are always giving the same look to the defense. We wanna catch, Right-handers, we want to lean up, lean on that left foot a little bit as we catch the ball. We start our cheat step, all right, and we will catch, gather, throw. This is simply catch and throw. What kind of route is that out of the receiver? It is a shallow, short, probably underneath five yards of a route, and it's time to catch it and get it to him, get it to a good player in space as quick as possible. So let's snap it on go. All right, you can work independently here. Catch it, gather, throw into the net. All right, let's take a peep at it. Good, there you go. Good, right there, good. We have to make sure here that our feet go right to our target with our front shoulder, turn it and throw. Tight circle, rip it right down here to the left pocket and we're not running all over the place. All right, this isn't, we don't have track videos right now. We're not throwing the javelin and we're running and catching it. Okay, stay right on your spot. Catch, turn, throw. Let's do it. Tighten this up here a little bit. There we go, good. Tight circle, good. Rotate in there, car. That a boy, good, nice. And get it to him quick as we can. Good, that a way. One simple concept here I want to make sure everybody gets. When we say get on top of the ball, okay? On top of the ball means I want to throw it with my fingers, all right, up to the top of the ball, getting almost a downward plane on the ball. Underneath means our elbows leading first, our hands under the ball, and the ball's kind of squirting out the top of my hand, okay? So we want to go quick, get on top of it, and flip it into that net while not leaving our spot. All right, our second drop here, we're gonna have a longer, more of an intermediate route, depending on how fast, how old your receivers are, where we wanna take one big step, two steps to gather our feet, and then throw the ball in the direction that we wanna do so. So we will catch from our athletic stance, good posture, our eyes are up, we are ready to command the entire stadium with what we're doing, we catch, one big, two gather, and throw the ball. Eight to 10 yard routes is what we're looking at here. Go, let's throw it in there. Get that front shoulder in the direction. Good, very nice, good. Very rhythmic. Keep a nice rhythm, tight circle. Good. Nice, very good. Jump right up here. Ditch the camp snap, let's get some throws. There we go. Working with your partner at home. Get mom and dad snapping it to you. One big, two little, gather and throw. Point to your target. Very nice, good. Okay, as we reset here, our last drop here is we're gonna take a play action type of move. Whatever you've got in your playbook, whatever you think your coach may call, let's get to that position. So in this one, we're going to mesh to our left, both of you, step to him, right, nine o'clock, reach the ball out, mesh to my front foot, and then take three steps back, okay? 10, 12, 15 yard route, correct? Maybe something into the middle of the field where we need to get ourselves a little action, let's move some defenders, let's get some depth here, let's finish it seven yards deep, 
working with our offensive line in harmony so they know where we're at and we know where they're at. Okay, right to our left, three-step drop, throw it in the net. Keeping our mechanics here. One, two, three, and three. Good, like it. Rip it. Good. Step to it now. Get your footwork in before you drop, right? We want to make sure that whichever way we ride it, set down, push off that front leg. One, two, three. Always come straight back or in the direction that your coach wants you to. Be loaded, comfortable, flip, stay on my spot, okay? Let's finish down at that left pocket now. All right, finish down there. Very good. So, to kind of wrap this drill up here, you all know when you're playing quarterbacks, whether you're middle school or youth league, you've got those base running plays that you know you're gonna run. We're gonna have some type of action off of it. We're gonna drop, and the key here is execute your play action. Let it work for you. Don't rush through it. Get my three steps, sit down, and let that thing rip and be on time. That way we'll run great plays and score touchdowns.